Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a glowing sky effect in After Effects. I've already made a few glowing sky tutorials, but many of you mentioned that the mask wasn't tracking properly and the effect looked messy. So in today's video, I'll be using a rotating shot and show you exactly how to track the mask so the glow follows your entire clip. Let's get started. First create a new adjustment layer. On that layer, apply the first effect, glow. I'll set the values I normally use, but feel free to experiment and find the look you like. Set the glow threshold to 25%, glow radius to 1000, glow intensity to 0.2. Next apply curves. Pull the shadows slightly to the right to darken the darks, and pull the highlights to the left to brighten the brightest areas. After that, apply Gaussian blur. Set the blurriness to 25. Now apply glow one more time using the same settings, except keep the glow intensity higher this time. We want the second glow to be stronger for a brighter result. If you have deep glow, you can use that instead, it gives a smoother, better looking glow. But the built-in glow works fine too. Now that the effects are ready, the next step is masking. Select the rectangle tool and mask only the upper part of the video, something like this. My video is slightly rotated, so I'll quickly adjust the mask so it lines up perfectly with the horizon. Then click the toggle switches slash modes and change the adjustment layers blending mode to screen. Now press F on your keyboard and set the mask feather to around 300 to soften the edge. You can keep adjusting the mask shape until it looks perfect. This looks good, but we still need to track the mask, and this is where most of you had issues. If we don't track the mask, the glow will stay in one place and the effect will look completely wrong when the camera moves. So make sure you're at the beginning of the clip with the mask perfectly aligned. Press M to reveal the mask path, then click the stopwatch to create a keyframe. Now move to the end of the clip and adjust the mask again to match your footage. Once that's done, preview your video, the glowing sky should now follow your clip perfectly. Don't skip this masking step, it's the key to a clean result. Track the mask carefully and make sure it's 100% accurate. Hope you found this video helpful, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.